Hello and welcome to the Daily Gas for November 20th, 2024, called Givens by Philip Newman. Normal Sudoku rules apply. Between lines, digits along a line must have values strictly between the values in the circles on the ends of that line. So what does that mean? Well, we have a 3 here. Let's say just for ease of use, this is 7 because uh, it breaks. Uh, what that means is all the digits that appear on the line must be digits that appear between 3 and 7. So that's 4, 5, and 6. So those are the valid uh, digits. So 1 could never go on this between line uh, because it is not between 3 and 7. So on and so forth for all the between lines throughout the grid here. Those are the rules. Let's just jump right into it. <laughs> all right. So... Actually, here is the easiest between line to look at. We have a 3 here, we have an 8. Well, the only way that 8 can be between 3 and another digit is if that other digit is 9. What that means is this could be any of the digits 4, 5, or 6 to satisfy uh, the between line here. So that is not, uh, not so helpful. 3, so 6, 5, hmm. It has to be 4, 8. So this this has to be another 9 then, I guess? Because this has to be 4, 8. Because these are all of the digits that are between 3 and 9 here. So yeah, that's it's, it's quite uh, quite prescriptive. But there we are. So the it is 3 and 9. And then these will be the digits um, 5, 6, 7, 8. Hmm. I guess one nine. Oh well, that's the easy bit, right? One and nine must go in these two cells here, because it can't go on a between line. One and nine in general can never go on a between line unless you're using zero or ten in your Sudoku, right? They can only appear on the ends of the between line. So the leftovers are five, six, seven, eight. So like here, this is five six five six three. Hmm. All right, there's got to be a better way to look at this. What can this be? Two. So three four five is the best that you're gonna do. So this means to be this needs to be nine again. Sorry, it has to be at least six, so it must be nine because it can't be six seven or eight. 9 now actually gives us our 9-1 order. 9 means this is very unrestricted. All right, the name of the puzzle is Givens, and I wonder if there's just a bunch of Sudoku that I haven't been paying attention to. So 1, there we go. We've actually resolved one over here. 2-3. Um, two, 2 can never go on its own between line. 2 can't go here, so this is 2. Then... Three, four, five, all of those are valid on the between line. Two, three goes in one of these two cells, which means it goes in one of these two cells. Ah, so three goes here, right? Because it can't go on its own between line. Then, we know three will have to go somewhere here, so this must be three, which means our five, six pair ends up here. Two, one, hmm. Five, six, eight, and what? What are what am I not seeing? Ah, four. Where is four gonna go? Three, four, five. Did I say four, five, six before? Three, four, five. This is four, five. Hmm. Seven has the same sort of thing happening, except it has two possible digits or cells hmm you know philip for all the the givens i seem to be uh, struggling to place anything eight ah sudoku tells us eight goes here it's that that is almost all givens um 
Now five, six, seven. This must be seven because of the five, six. Now this is five, six, five, six, which makes sense. One, two. Ah, uh, where does two go? That's Sudoku. Where does one go? That's Sudoku and between lineage. Those are those are just things I could do with all the givens. Again, I'm overlooking the, the name of the puzzle. Four, five, six. Hmm. All of them are valid on the between line. Four, six, eight, and two, actually. This is two, six. One, two, six, seven, eight. One, seven. Hmm. I'm struggling to see it, folks. I don't know why. My brain just ain't uh, working for me. One. One can't go in a between line. There we go. One can't go in a between line. Twos. Three, nine. Ah, uh, this is two. Which makes this three, nine, which I guess makes sense with all the three nines, but it doesn't help us place the five sixes here. All right, fours. Fives, sixes, sevens. Aha, seven. Eight, eight. Like the two, actually. Eight. Eight can go in either place. Either place, and then nines. So close with the nines, but we're missing all the nines from uh, from the top here. Um, though actually, wait, nine has to go in one of these two cells, in one of these two cells, which means this must be nine. Using our, our X-wing logic there, right? If Because if nine goes here, nine goes here, nine here, nine here, which means neither of these two rows can have nines in them. Nine. Three, four, five, six. Three. Three, five, six. Four, five, three. Yeah, just uh, it's just not clicking, not clicking. Four, five, six. It's a slow day for me. Wait, this can't be one, two, three, four, five, seven. Eight, it must be six. That's just a naked single here. This is six. Three, four, five, five, four, five, and seven. Hmm. Four, five, seven here as well. Four. All right, we're back to Sudoku again. Two cannot go on its own between line. 
this is simply 8. 8 gives us 8, gives us 8, gives us 1, 4, 1, 4 gives us 4, 5, 6 is now resolved. This is 5, this is 6, this is 5, 5, oh, 6, 6, 5, 5, 6, sorry, 6, 5, 4, 4, 5, 3, 3, uh, 3, 4, 4, 3. From the column, we need 5. And all of a sudden, all my dreams are coming true. This is 2. This is 6. All right. And then 1 goes here. 2, 7, 2, 7. Cross, we need seven here, five, six, six, five, three, nine, four, seven. All right, and this can resolve it. Four and what? Four and five, five, four, four, seven. It doesn't help us with our three, nine, though. So three and something, three and. 6, ah, there we go, 6, 3, 3, 9, and then finally, that is A, 3 in the corner, and we get a 7 here, and we are done in 10 minutes and 36 seconds with Givens by Philip Newman. Definitely should have paid a little bit more attention to the uh, <laughs> the name of the Sudoku there, though clearly i'm uh, i'm just i'm just a little slow today and that happens so hopefully uh, you won't uh, you won't be too harsh on me in the comments there but uh, as i always say i hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching